Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our tech is and this is iPhone 6s in my hand and the problem is that the phone was stuck on the iCloud activation lock screen and in this video I'm gonna show you how can you unlock this uh, iCloud activation lock problem. So basically when you uh, buy this kind of phones means iPhones from Craigslist, eBay from that kind of website you will get your phone that uh, your phone stuck on this kind of activation lock screen. So here it is uh, it's asking for a uh, iCloud ID and the password to activate this phone so in this video I gonna show you the easiest method means is the easiest way to open the iCloud activation lock and this is a completely 100% working method and you can try it so and here it is uh, and I have tested it for iPhone 6 on my previous video and I have also tested in I on iPhone 5s and now I'm testing it on iPhone 6s I have not tested in a, on iPhone 7, 7 Plus right now. I will test it after a couple of days, but right now I'm testing it on iPhone 6s. And it, so let's see. So it's first of all, let's do that process. Uh, first of all, uh, you require the iFlash drive uh, for that method. Uh, I, you can require the iFlash drive and directly download a file which is in the description the link for that file is in the description you require to use that file to unlock this iCloud activation lock and so let's see uh, how to do that so first of all simply go to that and let's see few minutes and uh, for that activation lock process, you uh, unlocking process, you require a SIM card. Uh, you require to insert a SIM card on the phone and also connect it to the Wi-Fi and then do that process. So on the Apple ID position, you require to give any kind of smiley which you like. So just uh, give the smileys. Must be sure that your smileys must be above uh, uh, 50, more than 50. Smileys are more than 50 on the Apple ID position. So press it and make it more than 50 and hope it's uh, now complete it's uh, 50 completed I think okay now it's 50 and the password must be more than 30 letters okay so let's start the password must be 30 above more than 30 letters and Okay, the phone automatically stuck over there so this is the first time here and then again next so the phone will stuck over there and it's us it will tell you the incorrect ID and the password again do the same uh, let's do it okay for from here start again and from again start again try it and let's do it and the Wi-Fi connection must be a proper uh, Wi-Fi connection you require to do this process uh, unless you will get a uh, 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 failed message over there so again do the same and now again this time must be 50 again means more than 50 smileys Hope it's uh, done. It's more than 50 right now. So. Yes, maybe uh, it's uh, maybe I uh, iOS version iOS 11 that is, Android. but I also tried it on iOS 10.3.3 and that version it's also working. And I don't know the version of this phone right now, but it's maybe iOS 11. It's more than iOS 11. That is the confirm. That is the. The icons are seems like iPhone iOS 11. So let's see which iPhone iOS version is that. I will see that. Check that for later. So again, the password. Give the password. And more than the letters will be more than uh, 30. Again, quiet. And again, the phone will automatically stuck over there until means this uh, keyboard will be gone or something like stuck over. Uh, the screen will stuck. So. Hope it's 15 and the screen until do it until the screen will freeze. If not freeze, no problem. Just okay. It's 
it's like yeah it's not freezing right now so yeah do that too I okay, hope it's uh, more than 50 now. Next, um, like, uh, second. Now you require to use this iFlash drive. Okay, now you require to use this iFlash drive. Okay, you start again, and you require to uh, load it with a file that is uh, 16 gigabyte, uh, 16.42 uh, gigabyte file, which you get, which you require to download. It from the given link below the description and if you uh, think that a 16.4 gigabyte file was too long uh, uh, then you can try the custom firmware method it means custom IPSW firmware method and uh, this will also work for your phone that is means uh, uh, the iOS version will be same like uh, but the it's will it will be modified iOS version you can try this method and it's completely not jailbroken method so you can try it properly so uh, but right now the custom uh, firmware for iphone 6s was not released yet uh, so you can try this custom firmware method for up to iphone 6 okay so you can try it uh, and now and this method is for only 16 gigabyte model not for 32 64 okay so let's check it okay it's coming it's uh, Okay, it's connected now and now again do the same process so here it is connected the high flash drive has been connected right now and do this process again okay again apple id like smile is more than 50 any kind of smileys you can use it okay must be smileys are must be more than 50 not a particular smiley you, you to use but it must be more than 50 use it Hope it's right now more than 50 and in the password must be more than 30 digits and 30 letters okay something dropped here just a second actually Okay, and this uh, is and now it seems uh, it's more than 30 again. And let's then try this at all and cut next. Okay, now it's uh, completed, and there it is. Let's try it next. And so it's right now it's completed. So here it is, it's a complete now bypass. So this is the here you can see it's uh, the touch up ID is spelled. But don't use forget. Don't use pass. So uh, the bypass has been successfully completed. You can set it as a new iPhone also. You restart restore from your iCloud backup also. I'm right now setting it as a new iPhone. So and the very important thing which you require to know that this is a uh, temporary bypass not a permanent bypass okay now remove this uh, iflash drive and surely it's uh, completely 
uh, not a permanent bypass it's uh, just a temporary bypass if means temporary means like you can use the, uh, this phone as much you can until you your phone was uh, means restored if you restore your phone then the iCloud will be again back on your phone and you can again you have to do the same process to bypass the activation lock so I don't know at that time the that method will work or not but you can try that again at that time if your phone uh, means you will you will restore the phone at that time again you can use it as it so let's set up with a new iPhone and create a back and use different okay don't have apple id forget it as uh, don't use and okay and then continue uh, don't say choose view and next so it's so on the home screen it's completely bypassed the icloud activation lock and so here it is completely bypass so so let's check the iOS version about this phone first okay, okay it's iOS 11.11.1.1 so this is the iCloud version right now and so this is a simple way in that way you can easily uh, unlock your iCloud lock problem and you can also uh, use uh, if you don't want to download 16 gigabyte uh, file then you can try this um, custom firmware method if that will also work for your phone so if you like this video then please click on thumbs up and don't forget to like and subscribe this channel thanks for watching this